at the teachers and the Highlands Area School District. They started their negotiating session about 30 minutes ago, but the two sides are far apart. They both say that they differ in what teachers should make by about $1 million. Kids in the Highland School District won't have a school day like this for the next eight days if their teachers go out on strike. A 16-month bargaining period has not yielded a new contract. Lives will change a bit for parents seeking child care during the strike. Everybody deserves a, a fair wage, but um, I, I feel like at the end of the school year, it takes away from the kids. You know, uh, this will extend the school year eight, eight more days, and that's rough on kids. I understand there's a lot of parents who probably it's going to be difficult for them. I'm lucky enough to be a stay-at-home mom, so it won't really affect me, but honestly, most of the people in this area, I'm sure it's going to affect majorly. Salaries for teachers in the Highland School District are in the lower percentile among all teachers in Allegheny County. The top salary at Highlands is one of the lowest in Allegheny County, probably bottom five. So you're looking to come up to some average? Wait. We're looking to come up to something respectable. But the Highland School Solicitor says teachers are picking a bad time to go on strike. To strike in April, when they can only strike for about eight days, in this community shows me that they just are not reading the pulse of the people that are paying their salaries. Now, both the teachers and the school district say they are hopeful that they can avoid a strike. But if not, the teachers will be on the picket lines tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. Reporting live from the Trona Heights, Sheldon Ingram, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.